Hi folks, this video is regarding word pencilation on Nginx. So most of the time you have seen you have you know working uh, word pencilation on Apache only. So here this is for Nginx. If you love Nginx web servers, so I'll go with installation of Nginx first of all. I just yum yum install Nginx and press Y. It will you know download the package and install it for you. So I'm just skipping skipping this part. I'll make it a bit faster. okay it's done so now I will you know install MariaDB because I'm installing it on CentOS 7 if it's CentOS 6 just go ahead with the install MySQL so you know it's kind of okay press Y and again Done now. You know, go with system CTL start nginx dot service. I wanted to check the status also that's running or not, so it's active and running. So, this is my website, and I'm um, you know, I'll you know, for I have created a document for this, so just follow this one. I'll go into cdwhtml. If it is not there, you can create it. I mean, it's okay to create this directory. So I have, you know, changed ownership of this <coughs> directory which I've just created. And then I'll in download the latest WordPress version using wget command. If it is not there, just install it. Yum install wget. done now you know I'll undo this dot table it's done I'll remove this again I don't want any tarball in my web server and I'll you know see the permissions and ownership has been in a messed up so I'll you know we change this ownership and permission again to chmod Seven seven five WP and this John hyphen on and the next okay. Now you know I'll log into the database. I'll create this database for you know holding up the WordPress database. Also, a user which will interact with this database um, and keep all the information for the WordPress website. So and uh, you know I have to give a password and uh, you know the permission to access database so they see this have got every permission because I fired up this command grant all privileges I'll press the privileges now see this is very very easy I have created a perfect document for this just follow document you won't you won't get stuck anywhere so just go in cd con dot d and create a file with ending dot com so I have created this one vimetc index and nginx dot com dot d with wp underscore test dot com and copy and paste it whole block just copy and paste it if you wanted to know what it is just comment I'll tell you line by line for this for a while for now just copy and paste this i'll go with ip installation so i'll remove this name and put in my ip this is 192.101.188 and i'll hit the change with saving this file with column wq see i need to disable this slnx feature for the this and I'm just set in for zero and SC Linux has been disabled. If you want to go with the context of SC Linux, you have to make some context changes. So I won't see this for now. So just delete, you know, you know, do this for a permanent basis. Just change the file and reboot the server. So we'll do it for you. 
now what uh, you know if you're going for an IP you know just skip this because I have already made IP configuration in this file that you can see previously it was with the name of a directory so I'm going with the IP so just skip this step now I'll go into uh, you know uh, HTML directory with my WordPress files are now see I'll make a copy of WP config sample file yes press ok why for writing maybe I have another file ok fine now you know I'll add this file using vm editor wp config.php and fill out the you know essential required for word installation that is database name username and the password of the user which will access the database so I've created the database with wp underscore db and the user is wp underscore user and the password was my yes see so and I'm kind of easy to so save the file and you know restart the nginx server because I uh, you know made some configuration changes in nginx.conf nginx configuration file so, and I'll enable this mydb to make it up and running even after every reboot so do with the nginx server if you are using this in a CentOS, just use the process. So this is my IP and this directory. I'll hit enter. So see it's loading up and fill out these details. Like site title is I uh, I'll go with KP test and you know admin anything. I mean just make it secret test and anything password email you know is essential so you have to take give an email address store wordpress see it's a success so okay we are good to go admin and password whatever it was okay login see this is dashboard so you have successfully installed it you know the problem was nginx and wordpress was because you know nginx do not support sjxs which was really important for uh, wordpress to work so anyway thanks for watching please subscribe to my youtube channel thanks for watching bye